Hi everyone, welcome to my channel and I hope you're all fine. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can clean up your soldering iron tips. After using a long time, your soldering iron uh, won't work properly and efficiently. So you need to clean it up or buy another one. And also this price a little bit hot, so some of you can't uh, afford uh, a new one. So you need to clean up your um, soldering iron tips and the main part of the soldering iron there are so many videos on youtube suggested how you how you can clean up your um soldering iron to some extent these methods can work but they won't uh, provide you a conclusive solution and you can just your use your um, soldering iron tips a little bit more but it won't be a conclusive solution as i said earlier uh, some people use uh, sandpapers to clean up the soldering iron tips and some other people use this um, grid stone to clean it up. But just as I said earlier, these two methods to some extent can provide you a solution but it won't be a um, long life solution. But in today's video, I'm going to show you a very um, simple, very easy but very practical and efficient way uh, to um, clean up your soldering iron now as you see the tip and the main part is oxidized when you uh, use for a long time your soldering iron tips because of the uh, high temperature the, oxi the oxidation will start and it will get darker after some times the thin oxidation layer will cover it completely and your machine w w won't work you need to clean it up as you see, it's melted it, but it's not um, stick to um, soldering. As you see, just um, fall down when you try to melt. Doesn't working very well. Now I'm going to show you how you can clean your um, soldering iron. First of all, I will remove the tip of the soldering iron. As you see, the screws are very dark and the, the dust covered it completely. Okay, when you look at this, and also this part covered with dust completely. And when you look at the main part of the soldering iron, inside it also covered with dust. It's not enough to clean only the um, soldering iron tips because if you don't clean inside it, the heat transferring won't be possible. So uh, if this is very clean, the heat transfer won't be possible from here to this part. So your soldering um, iron won't work very good. So we need to clean also this part, this part and the screws. Now I'm going to show you how we can clean it um, very well. Instead of using these materials, I am going to use just dust remover you can find it on supermarkets and buy um, this is very cheap you can also use hydrochloric acid sulfuric acid or phosphoric acid but those chemical but those chemical components are very difficult to find so uh, instead of them you can also use dust remover uh, to clean up that to clean up your device i will put some dust remover into a glass And I will put the uh, tip inside it and the screws also put inside it. And I will also put the main part of the soldering iron inside it. And we will wait about um, 10 or 15 minutes. As you see, uh, it start to work and you see the bubbles, it will uh, slowly clean the iron and after 15 or 20 minutes we will wash all of the parts with the water
after waiting 20 minutes, I'm going to um, clean the components with a dishwire. But before um, using this process, I highly recommend you to your um, hand gloves for your self protection because the dust remover is a very highly corrosive compound and it can damage your hands. Please use your hand gloves when you cleaned um, the components, the materials with the dishwire. I'm just take on my hand glove and I will just take this dishwire and I'm going to clean with that. As you see, it's almost completely cleaned. Now I'm going to clean with plenty of water and put everything together again. I've just washed everything and dried it well. Now it's time to uh, put everything together again. And after that, I will show you how it will work. Our new um, soldering iron tips. Okay, it's ready now, time to test and see how it works. Okay, my friends, our soldering iron tip is ready to test before we clean it up. The soldering wire didn't stick um, to the tip, but now we will try to see if it sticks or not. Okay, as you see, it sticks very well, it works very well. According to the beginning, it works very well. Now, we will just um, solder this small speaker and use its effect okay you see that's very nice it soldered it very nicely you see Just solder the other one. Okay, my friends, that's very nice. We cleaned it, we cleaned our soldering iron tips. Uh, at the beginning, it didn't work, but now it works very properly, very efficiently. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe my channel and see you in the next video. Take care of yourself, my friends.